Hi there, folks. Welcome to La Cala Resort Golf Academy. My name is Murdo McCorkadale, and working alongside Golf Magic, I'm going to continue this small string of instructional videos. So today, what I want to talk about is the driver. Now, here I'm using the, the brand new M5 tailor-made driver, which uh, is the latest technology. It's all to do with the glue that they inject into the, the club face, which uh, basically gets the, the golf club as close to illegal as possible without being illegal. So it's, it's brand new technology, and it basically means that all golfers, club golfers, club pro golfers, amateur golfers, are using the same clubs as the guys on tour um, as far as the, the COR, the club, the club head technology is concerned. So, so in the past, they got all the good ones, and we had to make do with the rest, but now everybody stuff. So, with a driver, now, a lot of people come for driving lessons and they say, oh, I can't hit my driver. Of course, we always say, well, let me see you hit a few seven irons, eight irons first, because uh, usually the, the, the root of the problem goes more than the driver. But, but sometimes it is that you get up with the driver. If the ball's too far back in the stance, you're in big trouble. So, really, got to make sure your ball position's left to center. Got to make sure that the butt of the club, the rubber, is pointing to the buckle of the trousers. And I feel like I'm loaded up. I've got a across here on the mat, and my head has to be in this right-hand box the whole time. If that head, if my head gets into that left-hand box, I'm in serious trouble. It's going to be divity, you're going to be taking divots, and that's never a good thing with a driver. So I've got to stay behind the ball. Now, I put a stick on the ground here, and this stick is really helpful, because basically, when I go to the top of the backswing, I want to feel my shoulders are on top of that stick. That's what I'm looking for, because if I get to this position and my head stays too central or it even moves to the left, it's never going to be a golf shot with a driver. So, get myself set up. Club face, sitting on the ground, just trust the guys that made the golf club. They know how to design golf clubs. You just let it sit and that's the way the club head should be. Never try to change it. Just let it sit. Doesn't matter if you're hitting it right or left. It's not going to help by trying to change it. You're going to have to sort something else out to do that. So, staying behind it left shoulder towards the target, left elbow towards the target, that gets you in a stronger position. And then from there, moving it back and really giving it a good whack. That's important as well, obviously. So the main points, left shoulder down the line, left elbow to the target, good ball position, butt towards the buckle of the trousers, leaning back just a touch at the setup, feel loaded up, move off the ball, make sure you go to the right. It's not a problem if your head even turns with it a little bit. Dustin Johnson, Tiger Woods, they do that to help the shoulder turn. That's a very good thing to do, but the most important thing, stay behind it and pose at the finish even if it's a bad shot. 